baby corn. It's what's for dinner. Mmm. I'm just waiting for this to load. And then it's time to go shopping. All right, going to Forever 21. Because Jenny's birthday is coming up and I want to get her something. She kept telling me, no, don't get me anything. My Jenny impersonation. So finally she told me she needs some summer clothes and then still told me that I don't need to get her anything. And she likes H&M and Forever 21. Me too, Jenny. I am a gift person. If you've ever heard of the five love languages, my main one is gifts. That's how I receive love. My second one is words of affirmation. I always say I have the two most vain love languages. Buy me something and tell me I'm pretty. JK. Of course it's deeper than that. I think gifts for me is like that person thought of you when they weren't with you. They either thought, oh my gosh, I like them, love them so much, I'm gonna go get them something, or they were out and saw something that reminded them of you and spent their hard-earned money and got it. It's just so thoughtful, and especially when it's a gift that's so you, it's like, Oh my gosh, you know me! <laughs> I wish I had more money so I could buy the people in my life stuff all the time, but I don't. So at the very least, I make it a point to get them things on birthdays and holidays because I want them to know I love them and they're special and it's just great to be celebrated. Oh, there it is. This store is dangerous for me, oh my gosh. So, I have to thank Jenny. Okay, I know I'm Jenny shopping, but this dress is super cute. I've been looking for stuff I could wear to both work and that I would wear outside of work. Okay, this stuff is cute. I could maybe see Jenny and stuff like this. She dresses super cute like that. Yay, they have their 380 leggings again. Forever 21 are my favorite leggings. 780 denim, can't beat that. Oh yeah, it's cute for work, I think, with a belt. Good jeans because I need a pair and I haven't bought any in years and they're only $7.80. So what's funny about my outfit today is that it's all Forever 21, including the boots and the socks I'm wearing. I also wanted to come here for sunglasses per Katrina's recommendation. You can never have too many pairs of sunglasses, guys. Okay, I had to get out of there. I did damage. $85 worth of My battery died. How rude. As I was saying, I got Jenny a dress. It was the one I saw on the mannequin. I also got her a gift card because I felt like one dress wasn't enough. For myself, I got that blue dress, two pairs of jeans, a light and a dark, and these two sunglasses. Thanks for coming along with me. Bye. I'm just getting Jenny's gift together right now. Gift card on the bottom. Folded the dress. I left the tag on it because she's super small and the dress is a small, but she may need to return it because it might be too big for her. I'm doing this red and white heart tissue paper because I heart Jenny and red is her favorite color. And then I'm wrapping it in this fun, cute, happy birthday pink paper. And here's the card I got her that kind of matched, I thought. I didn't bring any ribbon with me, but I brought options for bows. What are we thinking? Because the paper has like greenish and purplish in it. Maybe I should just do it like that. Bow it up. I went with the darker pink one. I liked it. There you go. So look who it is, guys. Happy birthday to this one. Thank you. How have you been? I have been good. So yeah, good. And who is this? This is my husband, John. Nice to meet you, husband John. Actually, this is the famous John Huber. Anyone that knows anything about yo-yoing, look him up. There he is. From Phoenix, Arizona, John Huber. To the deep end, to the hard line, hold You're welcome. Do you like pink? I know red's your favorite color. Are you like into pink? Because I did your stuff in pink because I'm like pink. I'm not a big pink fan, but that's okay. Can't put her on the spot and ask kinds of questions. I can edit it out. That's the thing. And I left the tag on it in case it doesn't fit because I know you're super small so you can like return it. Well, I was worried, you know, it's a small but like, you're welcome. Happy
happy birthday! Yay! You're welcome! Fish and rice and rice and meat and a burger. Burger. <laughs> and fish. It's filming. Okay. Oh, yeah. I don't have anything to say though. This is Jenny's birthday! Yay! Happy birthday, Jenny! Jackson! I know! <laughs> That's how you that's how you clap in sign language. Is it? Yeah. Is this? Yeah. Clapping. Yay! Dinner was good. It was a good time. Thank you so much for the menu. You're welcome. And we're gonna go paint the town red, because that's the same. <laughs> So how are you going to get through your new vow of non-violence? I don't think I am. <laughs> you've already given up on it? So it's not really a vow then, if you've already basically committed to breaking it. No, I haven't. I'm going to try. Okay, how are you going to handle your anger issues? <laughs> I should take up like, what are you going to do when you, when you feel like you want to lash out in harm against something else? <laughs> I'm gonna eat my feelings. I'm gonna eat my feelings. <laughs> eat your feelings? Oh. Like, eat your feelings? Like, eat my feelings. So when you're angry, you're just gonna grab a handful of those fries and stuff them in your mouth? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I should take up, like, Taekwondo or something. That's not. <laughs> I don't think no, you understand. It would be against other people. Like, it would be, like, against the punching bag. It's gonna be you and a fight each other in Taekwondo. <laughs> You're Asian. You don't know what that is. Taekwondo is the Korean karate, duh. So, it's like the art of like throwing people, right? Uber fact. Uber, Uber fact. fact, yeah. Taekwondo may or may not be an Asian karate form. <laughs> Take up Tai Chi and eat your feelings. <laughs> Good plan. That, I just saw violence around the world. We're gonna we're gonna engrave the word feelings on the fries. <laughs> feelings fries. Eat these instead of violence. Patented. We've already patented that. That's a thing now. Feeling fries. Yes. Feeling fries. Love it. I'm going back to Instagram. <laughs> That's gonna be a really boring video. On Instagram? Yeah, but it'll be like what it's like in real life. This is real life, Hannah. It's so rude. <laughs> it's like hanging out with Hannah. That's it. You're really. You're not gonna talk to your viewers. I have the Instagram, okay?